Spider-Man vs. Iron Man. This comic starts with a hitman aiming in on Peter, Aunt May, and MJ. He saves Aunt May from the gunshot, but it hits MJ, killing her on the spot. While holding her, he gets shot in the back. We cut to the hitman who is on the phone with his client, when Peter sneaks up behind him, picking him up by the neck, asking him who sent him. And he says Kingpin. He starts to reach for his gun, but Peter grabs it, shooting him in the stomach, killing him. We see Kingpin in prison, setting this all up from the inside. Peter makes it back home, confessing to Aunt May about killing the shooter. She tells him to go to the police, but he doesn't listen. And he goes to get on his suit, which is actually the black suit, and that's not to be confused with the symbiote suit, even though it is designed to look like it. We then see Iron Man, who was tasked with taking down Spider Man for breaking the Superhuman Registration Act, set during Civil War. Peter makes it to Riker's prison to see Kingpin getting put under Shield's protection. He chases to their vehicle and tries to whip it into a building, but Iron Man catches it. He knees him in the back and also dodges his repulsor blast. He tells Tony that Kingpin had MJ killed, which shocks him, and Peter uses that time to hit him really hard over the head. Two guards shoot at him while the rest take Fisk away.